Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Mrs. Sumba and in case you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe. So guys, today we are doing a video of arranging my baby's nursery. As you know, I'm having a newborn baby, so I have to manage my space with her. So the only way my space can look so decent is by arranging her clothes decently and make the room look more spacious. So today I'll be taking you through guys. Uh, as you can see, the whole place is messy. So here, I've just, I've just sectioned these clothes. Like you can see here, these are the same uh, type of clothes. And then we have these. And then we have the trousers. And then we have the bibs. We have the... The sweaters and we have the dresses so these ones are clothes that she's not putting on right now they are a little bit bigger so i'm going to pack them in my in my other suitcase that i've set for her and then they will be removed maybe later and then these ones here i also want to pack them for later use the ones that she's not putting on right now i'll be keeping them so that maybe she'll just put them on later yeah, and I'll just tell you, uh, and I'll also show you how I will arrange her closet and everything. So please stay tuned. Guys, this is where I'm going to put her clothes. It's not a bigger space. It's where I'm hanging some of my clothes. That's why you're seeing the jackets hanging there. But I will put her clothes there because the clothes that she's wearing are not that much. So that's where I'll be putting them for now. So these are her heavy clothes. I'm going to put them inside her diaper bag because they can't fit the suitcases, the suitcases that are carrying her clothes. So I'm just going to put them there to give me an easy time of accessing, accessing them whenever I need them. So um, I'll ju I'm just going to fold them because they are already washed. So I'm just going to fold them, then make sure that they are well arranged on the diaper bag. So that even if um, my nanny wants to get some clothes, the, she doesn't have a hard time on getting with what clothes or like uh, disarranging everything while looking for uh, baby clothes. That's why I'm doing this arrangement. And then I've put them according to the sizes. The ones that she's almost putting on, I'm putting them closer. Are like uh, towards the upper part of the suitcase and then the ones that are, are a bit bigger i'm putting them on the lower part of the suitcase so this one gives me an easier easier time for any other mom outside there i think you know that babies um clothes can be so messy if you don't plan them well so that's what i don't like in my house that's why i do this on my own and make that make sure that i set them in a way that even if i need something i can get it easily yeah how I, I differentiate the clothes. These are the wrong parts. 
the trousers and the tights and then these ones i don't know what they're called yeah these ones on one side and then the the capes and then i have the socks all these socks they have the other inside the other side inside i put them like this because i don't want to lose all the socks because when you wash when you do the washing the socks get lost most of the times even the mittens each mitten has its own side inside it and then these socks what i do this bag i used it to buy the the person's oil for the baby so meanwhile i put the socks inside here and the mittens So guys um we are almost coming towards the end of the video this is where now we air all our clothes um it's a very nice place but now the problem is when you're putting clothes here the person above you must not be washing or else it, it's all going to be a mess yeah so these are the drawers that you're arranging the things that the baby things this is hard drawer these are hard drawers uh, we put all these diapers in there to make sure that uh, it gives you an easy time while arranging them while like picking them when you want to change the baby or something so yeah that's where we put them actually guys um one thing you have to know with toddlers uh, many people say that like no it depends with you like my house is always tidy um i always prefer my house being tidy all the time and this the place you set for mm. your nannies or any other person who is living with you is how they copy ukianza na uchafu then they will copy that just that so you have to be like clean on your own before you start telling someone that you need a clean house you have to be organized you have to like have have like a proper arrangement of your things so that when someone someone new comes into your house they have to copy whatever thing you're doing but you just you can't just wake up and get someone new in your house and then start telling them that nataka nyumba ikuwe safi but in the real sense you you are you cannot even keep the cleanliness to your own so yeah and also this is my baby soap dish and those ducks there they are so amazing she's using Casson's oil 
at the moment but we are planning to change to johnson's and we'll see if that one will work so as i was doing my work uh, my sister was taking care of the baby and basically she got she fell asleep and yeah she's on her bed uh, her baby coat and we are just thanking god when she's asleep when she's sleeping we do what we can do when she's awake then we take care of her and right now she doesn't need so much attention uh, the only thing you need to do is just watching her um making sure that she's fed well and everything yeah That's all about the video guys. My baby is already sleeping. Until next time, please don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye. I love you so much.